Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. As you can see, this is my skincare routine, drugstore morning skincare routine. So let's go ahead and get right into it. So what you guys are going to see me doing first after showing all the products that I'm going to be using, what you're going to see me do first is wet up my face. I don't like putting my facial cleanser on just like dry skin. That's weird to me. So I just wet it up a little bit, make sure it's damp. And then the facial cleanser that I was using was the Soak and Glory. Um, if you watched my March Favorites video, I talked a little bit about another one of their products. So obviously this is probably going to be in my like April Favorites or something. But yeah go ahead and watch that if you already did it but with the facial cleanser it's just a face soap and clarity cleanser with vitamin c what you want to do is use a very small amount like you just saw me do there and i just put it on my face i don't put it on my um i don't put it on my facial scrubber because it's like it's kind of like jelly gel and it'll like get everywhere so i just want it to sit on my face and then i'll go over like the different areas once i get my scrubber so that's just what you're going to do. And when you are washing your face, you want to make sure that, you know, you get all over your face and that you do it for at least a minute because that's when your face will actually get clean. And yes, I was, <laughs> I was wearing a jumbo size bonnet, but you know, it is what it is. At this point, I'm pretty sure my bonnet is tired of being worn because we've been in the house so long, but you know, Miss Rona is here to stay, I guess. But yeah, what you're going to see me do is just go all over my face all over all over all over all over and just making sure i get all over my face again if you guys watch my videos there's a lot of repetitive themes in all of them but you know So now that my face is clean, I'm just going to pat it dry because you want to pat instead of rub so you don't get no wrinkles prematurely. And then I'm going to spray my face with my um, toner, which I use the Thayer's Facial Mist Witch Hazel with Aloe Vera. The scent doesn't really matter. They have a bunch of scents. I prefer the cucumber scent, but at that moment I was using the rose petal one. But again, it doesn't really matter. Um, so, yep, I just went ahead and sprayed my face with the Witch Hazel. And I just, I didn't use like a cotton swab or anything like that because those like kind of soak up the product and I just wanted it to like sit on my face. So I just went ahead and patted my face, let it sit in for a second. Well, not a second, I let it dry up obviously. <laughs> you don't want to just be mixing stuff while it's still wet because then it's not effective. But just go ahead and pat it dry and then we can move on to the next thing. So next, I'm applying my my serum, which is the Pacifico, Pacifica, sorry, it's a Target brand, Pacifica Glow Baby Booster Serum with glycolic acid and vitamin C. Vitamin C is really good for people with dark spots, it helps your stuff brighten up, which we can all see that I need that, and glycolic acid is good for your skin as well. 
I didn't even realize until watching this video that I had makeup on my robe, but PDs, Woody Dees, I'll get that little spot up. But um, again, just like with my um, witch hazel, I just want to pat it into my face, into my neck if there's excess because I exfoliated already. Like I said, I exfoliate in the shower and I exfoliate my neck as well. So you want to pat everywhere, make sure everything is covered. I usually try to keep it to my forehead because that's where a lot of my dark spots are, but you want, do want to make sure that you get it all over your face. So you just got to make sure that it's dry. Now I'm going to go over my face with my moisturizer. I just use the regular Lubriderm. Um, regular Lubriderm lotion, no scent, no nothing, because it's lightweight, no scent, and you know, it's just, you know, easy, easy breezy. So, just gonna go over that with all, go over my face <laughs> with the Lubriderm, and yep, I don't like putting like super like thick things on my face because my face is already naturally oily, so why add, you know, add to the madness? But to top everything off, I'm finished up my skincare routine. I'm going over with rose oil. The rose oil, it has apricot oil and sweet almond oil in it. So, you know, he dees what he dees. We just gonna go over that. I just like putting a little drop of that. Like, like I said before, I don't really like putting like oils and like lotions and stuff on my face because I'm already oily and it's naturally just gonna like you know but just to close it all up seal everything in i do put a rose oil over it and that's what you're seeing me do now so i hope you guys enjoyed this obviously i'm gonna come back with another one stay tuned for that one if you haven't checked out any of my other videos you go ahead and do that i will see you guys in my next one mm -hmm.